I'm doing a survey today. I've drawn the garden. I just want to see what space I've got to play with. Also, the garden is on a slope as represented by my dodgy camera angle this morning. So I need to find out exactly what the gradient is and whether my trains can cope with that. I've done my measuring up and I've been inside and done a few calculations and I've worked out that the plan I had for my line um, is going to result in a length to scale of about three quarters of a mile. I'm not happy about the gradient though. I measured up a rise of about 49 centimetres and a run of 673 centimetres and you can check my calculation for me if you like. But that gives me a gradient of about 1 in 14. While I was inside I did some tests just to see if the low I'm building, which isn't finished when you see it by the way, it needs a cab, so don't worry about that, that it looks weird. Um, I did some tests to see if it could cope with the gradient, and it could on its own. And the other two locos I've got, they could too. But the moment I tried to get them to pull anything, they were absolute rubbish. <laughs> they couldn't cope at all. I concluded that the best thing for me to do is run the track on the level. It does mean that I've got to put in raised track beds. Um, down this end of the garden. So I am glad I did the survey, it's given me a few things to think about and it just proves that it was worth doing really because if I'd just come out here and thrown some track on the ground uh, I'd have been very disappointed. <laughs> Not that I intended to do that, of course. <laughs>